my name is Rhapsody, and welcome back to the crumbling ruins of Dark Souls 2, Scholar of the First Sin Edition. I've only just remembered that this fellow is here. Okay, so, nothing I could do last time. I don't know why I even ended up coming here. Well, I do know why I ended up coming here, but it didn't end up being fruitful for me. So, it's time for us to leave this area. What was I going to do afterwards? Let's think. Nothing to do here, nothing to do here, nothing to do here. Have I done all of the memories? I'm pretty certain I've done all of the giant memories. Well, of course I've done all of the giant memories. Right, Dark Covenant was my next one. Dark Covenant. So, we need to go to all of the areas where the Dark Covenant exists. So, a very obvious one is down in the Black Gulch. Hope I haven't already done this one. I think I talked to the... I talked I talk to Dark Diver Grandal, but I don't really think I actually ever decided to go through any of his Covenant areas yet. I'm pretty certain that's true. I think it's this one that I want to drop down on. Well, hopefully I'm not wrong. It was, doesn't look like I really have that much more time to guess. It's, it's definitely this. Excellent. No? What? Oh no, this is definitely not where I want to be. Okay. Let's pop some life gems rather than some Estus. Oh, excuse me! Get the fuck out of my area, sunshine! Nope, that one didn't work. Well, at least it worked. Eventually. Okay. I think I need to be in human form as well to deal with Dr. Abergrandal. Maybe I just missed the plank, or maybe it's another drop down. I can never remember where this door is. I think it might be another drop down, but I'm also not certain. Maybe it's over there. Let's try over there first. I don't want to die and lose my... some amount of souls. Oh, poisoned again. Let's just quickly drop down here. And I was correct. We'll just ignore the fact that I was previously incorrect. Right? We're going to be ignoring that, right? Please ignore that. Okay. Dark Diver Grandal. Finally, I'm here. Open depths. And I'm already in your covenant. I thought I'm... Yeah, of course I'm in it. Uh... Give you a human effigy. Sorry, give you a human effigy. Thank you. And then let's enter the dark chasm. So, of course, I'm doing this quest line because this is entirely a PvE quest line, so it's definitely something that I can do. But also because there's a boss at the end of it, you need to do this quest line in order to actually fight. Uh, called the. What's it called? Dark Lurker, I think? I'm not entirely familiar with it. I think I tried to fight it a few times in my first playthrough, and it was just way too fucking hard, so I stopped. So it's... Okay, he's gonna have poise out the fucking wazoo. So I'm gonna need to do pokes. Poke. Roll away. Poke. Roll away. Okay, it looks like his stability is actually pretty fucking low when he's trying to swing his weapon. All away, and... dead. Excellent. Whoa! Okay, that wasn't fun. Okay, at least I can target you. Because I know there's people down here that are untargetable for some reason. And then you're a pyromancer. Okay. So if I get myself covered in water, this Pyromancer will be doing like zero damage to me per second. Let's go here. Get shit on, Pyromancer. Get shit on. Man, I was trying to do two-handed there. Okay, that's a great combustion that they've tried to unleash upon me. And goodbye, Pyromancer. You might know that that Pyromancer is wearing an item that we should be able to recognize. The Xanthus Crown. 
which of course was first seen in Dark Souls 1 in the, part, uh, the painted world of Ariamis, where we actually had to fight Xanthus King Jeremiah himself and then collect the crown after the battle. God, I can't see fucking anything. This is going to be terrible on YouTube, but don't worry. I can't see anything either, so you're not missing out on things that I can see. YouTube tends to make things a little darker than they actually are when it compresses. Oh, don't fucking hit me. Single-handed poke. Single-handed poke. God, ooh, that's not good. This guy could run the absolute train on me. Punish those rolls. Should also be noted this guy cannot be backstabbed, thanks to the fact that he is wearing the ironclad armor. Basically the turtle armor, right? He looks like a big old fucking turtle. Can't be backstabbed as a result. Okay, I'm gonna try and kill this one before I have to go down there. Excellent. Okay, quickly roll. I don't want to get hit by any of the big old pyromancies. Okay. Roll in and finish him off. Excellent. So I can't go down that until I have lit the torch in this area. As soon as I light the torch in this area, then that fall doesn't actually become deadly. It becomes the way to get out. So. Let's find the torch. Do we actually have to have a torch or do we... I can't remember. Do you have to use light from somewhere specific or do you have to... I don't know. I don't know. I can't recall. Uh, I have to go around this way. Read message. Try fire. Okay, I'm going to actually have to summon my own fire. Please tell me I actually have flame butterflies. Otherwise, I'm going to be really fucking mad at myself for coming down here without them. Yeah, it looks like I don't. Am I... Uh, is that serious? Flame butterflies. Any. At all. Nope, I can't light this. God. Is there supposed to be a fire down here that I can use? I feel like that would make a lot of sense. Try torch. Yeah, I don't... I just don't have... Lit torch, friend. Is there anywhere where I can light a torch here? Because if there is, I am so fucking down for that shit. That's bright up there. Is that a lit torch? Evidently it is lit by nothing. What is that even being lit by? It's no sense. Okay, it doesn't look like there's a torch. Well... I fucked up. I fucked up. This is my bad. I'm gonna have to go get a bunch of flame butterflies so I can actually fucking finish this thing. God. Now I'm gonna have to come back and kill all those people again. Okay. Flame butterflies. Where can I pick those up? Let's go back to Majula anyway because I want to spend this... these souls on... well, levels. Okay, you. Talk to me. Bearer up. Let's level up. Okay, Vit needs to stay at 9. My equip load, equip load needs to stay below 60, right? And then I need the third dragon ring as well. Hmm. Strength, dex, adaptability. So I've got kind of quality going on with everything else. I think I just want to go Vigor. Yeah, that's... I'm pretty vigorous right now. And the vigor is just mostly about getting myself so much health that I can take a bunch of hits without dying. Okay, you're... You sell pyromancies. Is it possible that you also sell flame, uh, flame butterflies? No. Okay. I can't imagine Carnelian is. But I'll check him anyway. Oh, he does reinforce my pyromancy flame, which is cool. The, uh, the clear bluestone ring is actually pretty effective for pyromancies as well. One day my but was... I believe you can get a clear bluestone ring plus one just by using a bonfire ascetic in the shaded woods, if I recall correctly. 
it's entirely possible I'm wrong on that front, so don't take my word as gospel, but I'm pretty sure something similar to that is something you could do. Uh, I've bought all of the stuff that I really am interested in. You don't happen to have flame butterflies, do you? Uh-uh. Lovely times, these. Uh, Shalqua is basically, like, my last hope here, because I'm pretty certain that Gillian doesn't have it. Gilligan, sorry. Hello, Shalqua. Why? Just because... Uh, nothing, of course. Oh, man. Come to... Come to old Gilligan, have you? Yeah, I'm here. I'm not gonna waste your time, buddy. Don't worry. You need, you need armor, of course. He's going sure? only sells armor. I was just making I'm absolutely sure certain. You. Actually, do you sell to the forlorn armor now? Looking for, looking for armor. What I sell is quite dependable. Um, there's the smelter demon stuff. The penal skirt, penal jacket, looking glass armor, Velstart's helmet, Velstart's legging. Who's the person that sells? Oh, you know what? Sure? It's strayed. It's Strayed who sells the Forlorn set, isn't it? Is it possible that Strayed sells Flame Butterflies? Okay, I'm gonna check Strayed, and if it's not Strayed, I'm gonna quickly Google it. Because I don't want to have to waste the whole episode searching down... Oh, where can I get some lost fucking butterflies, please? Actually, you know what? I'm gonna Google it now, but I'm also gonna check out Strayed, just because dude is dope AF. Flame butterflies. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, Google. Where can I find flame butterflies in Dark Souls 2? Uh, well, it did, it did bring up the Wikipedia page for flame butterflies. And it knew exactly what I was saying. It's obviously just couldn't give me a direct answer. What have you got? Sold by Weaponsmith Ornifex. Are you kidding me? It's Ornifex. <sighs> Man, of course it's fucking Ornifex. Why wouldn't it be? Alright. Just slice through these guys. Swing. And I'll stop two-handing so that I can just poke this one without angering Strayed. Bigger, stronger. There's the Hood of the Forlorn, the Gauntlets of the Forlorn, the Leggings of the Forlorn. These don't seem to weigh that much. Maybe they're like... Ooh, shit, what's this? All right, Lingering, lingering Frame. I don't uh, particularly use that one. But yeah, these don't seem to cost that much in terms of weight. I'm going to check out what I'm currently wearing in terms of weight. Because those have really good elemental resistances. Uh, okay, what I'm wearing is a lot lighter. Right. That makes sense. Okay, so it's Weaponsmith Ornifex. So I'm going to have to go to the Bright Stove Cones... Uh, Bright Stove Cone Seldora. Yeah, Bright Stove Cone Seldora. Let's go smoke some cones with Bright Stove. Where are you? There we are. Uh, I can't go to the lower one. I have to go to the Chapel Threshold. Because if I go to the lower one, I'm in the wrong area. Yay! Okay, so she sells them apparently for 6,000 gold each. So it looks like I'll be able to get two. Which is all right for now, I guess. Not enough eventually, but for now I should be fine. Sorry, I'm just gonna quickly close this door, if you don't mind. Oh, never mind. Roll! Nice work. Okay, on effects. I require no payment this time. Let's check out trade. Let's check out what we can get. The Wrathful Axe. Mm hmm? The ornament forged from the soul of Alana, child of dark. Use strong attack to unleash its latent power. When, he di when the abyss dissipated, the things that called it home were fragmented and sent across the realm. Eventually, these pieces regained form in ways that hinted at humanity's true nature. And there's, of course, Yorg's spear. Spear wielded by Sir Yorg during his invasion of Sanctum City. 
After his defeat of the sunken king, Sir Yorg pierced Sin, the slumbering dragon, with his spear to claim its blood. But Sin immediately awoke, spewing a pu uh, poisonous fog that blanketed the city in death, and Sir Yorg disappeared into the eternal sanctum. So these are all the things that I've already given up. Chaos Blade as well. Mm. That's for the old witch soul, so that's for... Right, that's that's for doing the new game plus version of that. Old Iron King soul. No. Cool, I'm pretty happy about passing up all of those. Just making absolutely certain. Now, buy. I got it. Ooh, it's 600. Oh man, I'm buying all of them. Fuck it. Come back again if you find another soul. That's my impersonation of you, Ward Effects. That's what you sound like. Rested bonfire. Now we can actually go do the stuff. Good fucking lord. I know, I know. We fucked it up and it's my, my bad entirely. I just forgot that you need to be able to light them somehow. For some reason, I thought there was going to be a torch in the cave that you'd be able to use to light your torch and then drag it along. But, nope. Need the flame butterflies. Okay. I still wish there was a pyromancy that just let you light your torch. Like... It would be a niche pyromancy, I admit that much, but I'd totally fucking use it. Because, look, I'm not using Flame Swap. Great, now I'm going to have to open this again. Yeah. Which means that I have to give another human effigy. Excuse me. Give another human effigy. Hey, no, no, no. Enter the... Exit that. And then let's disappear into the dark chasm of old. So I'm pretty certain the enemies have respawned. I don't remember resting at a bonfire, but... Oh, no, I totally did. I totally rested at a bonfire. Oh, they're not respawned? Oh, never mind, they totally are. What up, buddy? You ready? Get... Get wrecked? Oh, I fucked up. I have fucked up something bad. Whoops! Whoa, that was, uh, that was force right there. Excuse me. You know, I'm glad that I'm getting hit by the ones that aren't actually doing damage. Okay. We're making some progress now. We're making some progress. I know the progress is backwards, but not all progress strictly has to be forwards. Okay, now I'm covered in water. I feel a lot better about this. Okay. Oh, I'm still not particularly happy about what's going on right now. Oh god, the lightning attacks are going to be really bad because I'm covered in water, of course. Just need to get that one dead. Oh, okay, excellent. Now we're completely fine. Oh, easy life, easy life. Come and have a go if you think you're hard enough, son. Oh, man, almost got the backstab. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> Get piked on. Right. Let's go to the next area. Uh, actually, let's take the little trespass over here on the side and then like this oh it's beautiful unfortunately it doesn't light up the entire cave but I guess I understand why because then this place wouldn't really be that challenging I'm going to try and keep this torch up for just a moment so you can actually see on YouTube what's going on because I'm not using my Pyromancy flame offhand right now, so... I may as well just have something else in the offhand. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Damn it! Oh, I thought I was... I got so fucking punished for that. 
Whoa! No, 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 no. Oh, man, the Pyromancer's on my ass as well. This is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Run away! Chogestus. Okay. Hmm... First off, let's buff my weapon. This guy's not chugging the Estus right now. Took a lot of your poise to do those attacks, didn't it, buddy? Boom. Finished you off. And then... This guy's trying to come and get some. Oh, you know what? If you're gonna fight me one-on-one, -on -one, you can come get some. I thought you were going to try and gank me with the, uh, with the other fool down there, but the other fool is waiting. They're honorable. Okay, you're down. And... fuck it, I'll just hit you with flame swap. Gotcha. Nice, 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 and since I've lit the light... Fine work. Think carefully. Yeah, you need to make sure that you've lit the light before you fall down here, otherwise you just die. But instead, we have completed this section of the Covenant. Yeah. Dark Dive of Grandal. Your devotion to the Covenant is deepened and you've gained a rank. I'm dead. The dark beset upon you runs deeper than I had imagined. Let us see just how much dark you can endure. You have seen dark that has existed from times long past. What once was a great void of darkness became but fragments. That's the abyss. But slowly, the scattered fragments grew, absorbing all things. It is we who will be pilgrims to these sacred sites. Resonant soul. May the dark shine your way. And yours, Dark Diver Grundle. And yours. Okay. Returns the last bonfire. So, the other two locations are just above the Shaded Woods, and also just above the Shaded Woods, and in the King's Gate area of Castle Drang Lake. So let's go to the Shaded Wood ones first. Okay, Shaded Woods, Shaded Woods, Shaded Woods. Shaded Ruins, my apologies. It's going to be vaguely in the same area where we saved Weaponsmith Orn effects from her tomb. This guy's gonna try and come for me, but I have no interest in fighting him right now. So I'm just gonna run away. Okay. And then we don't want to fall down that trap. We want to fall down a different trap over in this area. Namely this one right here. And down we go. And guess what? Dark Diver Grandal is already here to see us. Fine. No. Yeah. Uh huh. Fuck, I always just. I'm spamming A to get through the conversation and I keep missing the ability to actually open the Dark Chasm. Okay. Oh man, we've got like two minutes left in this episode. Can I complete the Dark Chasm of Old in two minutes? My guess is probably. And I'm not, you know, try left. No. I'm not really that sad if I have to go a little over time in order to complete this area. Jumping required ahead. No, it's no, it's not. Okay, so someone is just straight up trying to put down troll messages everywhere. What a dick. Weakness miracles. Try ranged battle. Okay, there's a lot of them in there. Okay, I need to draw you out at least, like, one at a time. Whoa! That was pretty bad for me. Poke! Poke! Mmm, poke! Okay, this guy has, like, straight up no poise. Oh, neither do I. No! Okay, never mind. If I can just wheel and fucking deal you forever, I'll be fine. And gotcha. Consider yourself welt and dealt. Yeah. 
I figured I could probably just chug through that damage. And I could. Now there is but one opponent left. That's uh, being you. Oh, hey, Ricard. How's it going, buddy? That looks exactly like Ricard. Ooh, you're an archer now, are you? Where's your rapier? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that's not Ricard. Maybe it's just like a standard hunter or something. Uh, let's pop this flame butterfly. So there's still going to be some more fools to destroy, but it's okay. We're doing pretty well so far. I'm not going to even read that message. Not worth my time just to read that message to try and get trolled. Okay. Lever ahead. <laughs> yeah, good work. Good work on that one. Lever ahead. Wouldn't have seen it with my own two eyes. Excellent. So this is the only location I can actually go towards. Let's go. Ooh, downwards. Let's look this way. Gorgeous view of a blood stain. So you're over there. Right, right, right. Feel like what I want to do right now is buff this weapon. Because it feels like I'm about to get ganked. See, I have done this, but I haven't done it in Scholar of the Sin. Sorry, Scholar of the First Sin. But also, I haven't done this in ages. It was like years ago, back before the DLC for the first game came out, that I did this. No! Fuck you! Oh my god, that was so fucking close. I have a sliver of health left. Bonfire is... Whoa, okay, that's a pretty good drop. Gorgeous view. Excellent. Okay, that guy almost fucking got me. I'm pretty sad about it. But, now we can drop down here. Thanks to the fact that we've already lit the torch. And did that take two minutes? Shit, it took four minutes. God damn it, my apologies. Everyone out there. I'm gonna... Use this aged feather in order to get back to a bonfire so that I can say that my name has been Rhapsody. The name of the game has been Dark Souls 2 Scholar of the First Sin. Hopefully you've been enjoying yourself. If you have, please click like. It does help me get my content out to new people. There's also a playlist in the description down below with all my content on the Dark Souls 2 Scholar of the First Sin. Past, present, and future. And hopefully we will see you next time.